Before we start the reaction video, always remember to support the original content creator by using the links in the description below. Hey everybody, how's it going? It's Axel Grave coming back with more reactions with an X today, continuing on our battle mode journey from Doer Dreamer. We're doing a Captain Marvel vs. Blossom episode, which is episode 46. Getting close to episode 50, which is nearly halfway. He actually releases uh, one pretty often, so it's going to take us a little while to catch up. We'll probably catch up around the time of episode 140 or something, but for now, you know, support him using the links in the description. Check the bumpers on both ends for info on how to do that. And if you want to support us, check the Patreon out where, you know, you can get early access to a lot of our videos as well as uncut, unopacity versions of certain videos such as the anime reactions. You can also get, you know, content like comic stuff, the music stuff, uh, the gaming stuff. You know, we do a bunch of different stuff, stuff, stuff. And, you know, we really appreciate our current patrons. We really appreciate our YouTube viewers and subscribers, everyone who likes, comments, whether it be because you enjoy it or you want to give some criticism. It's totally understandable, and I appreciate every single one. Uh, with no more ado, let's just get into it. I don't want to bore you guys all the time, so. Battle mode. Yeah. Initiate. I don't want to bore you. <laughs> I like the new intro, the, the examples of his former stuff is a great way to like show off his work. And the, it's Boy, interesting how much quicker those Captain are. Captain Marvel versus Blossom. Which of these ladies will outpower the other? So this one's rough. If I had to go, I'd probably say Captain Marvel based on her power set. Because she really does scale pretty high at the end of the day if you go binary. Let's Otherwise, non-binary, I mean, our Powerpuff Girl is basically based on Superman in a lot of ways. Which, Superman's a kind of broken character, so... I'm not sure if she'd be able to defeat a Superman tier character without her binary state, depending on the Superman, of course. And this is animated by Josh Medley, the spider. Get him! Yeah! Oof. Went down, smooth. Oof! Blast off. Oh. There she comes. There she comes! Two energy beams! Ah, burn my laser! Oh. Is that the win? Ah, yep, alright, she's gonna go binary. Yep, for the power. Oh, jeez. But that, that was kind of what I saw happening. Captain Marvel. Uh, and that's, you know, whether people would like to admit it or not, unless Superman goes and supercharges in the sun, which I don't think is even relatively as close to some of the binary stuff. Like, she blows up planets in, when she's in binary form. That's like one of her big scares for that, is like, she's too powerful. Um, having said that, always support Duo Dreamer. These are great. I thought the animation was great, the logic was great, it was funny. Nice to add the little text. And the new intros and stuff are great. Look at that art. <laughs> That's so funny for the two pictures at What the are your end. thoughts on this animated battle? And if this was a research battle, who would actually win? Feel free to leave your thoughts and comments down below. Tell me what you guys think. We're going to discuss and debate about it. Thank you for watching and always dream big. We are going to always dream big. Thanks for watching. Uh, we are going to keep going on some of these, you know, in this series. But for now... We're going to go ahead and take a break. Thanks. This was Reactions with an X, and I really appreciate all of you.